Hello everybody and welcome to this brand new and crazy little let's play series on SimCity. Now, everybody's got a SimCity let's play series. What's going to be so special about this? Well, let me show you. It's on a Mac. Oh yeah, baby, we are macking it up. I have a Mac and not a PC and therefore I have been waiting since March to play this game. So let's create a game. Now, we're just going to go very, very low, just, just to see how the game works and see how good it is. So we're going to go to Cape Trinity, and we're going to keep this private for the moment, but, you know, if you're interested in coming and playing along, just hit us up a comment, and we'll see what we can do. What should we name this? What have I got around? Um, hmm. Uh, um, I have a TARDIS right next to me on my desk, so I'm going to rename. I'm going to name this Police Box. There we go. And we are going to start. Where do we start? Oh, it's got a bit of stuff. Uh, let's keep it simple. Let's start here. Let's start a clear water. So there we go. Active. Just claimed. Let's play. Now. I may do a little bit of skipping in and out of this because I have already been playing it a tiny bit. This is not just straight out of the box or out of the download. It's not download fresh. And there are problems with it and there has been a lot of complaints about what's going on with it. And at the moment, this seems to be doing okay. Um, one problem I've had with it is as soon as you start building things up, it gets really, really laggy. Like, you can't do this without it being really, really slow and awful. So, you know, we'll see what we can do. Now, if you've never played SimCity before, here's a brief overview of what you need to do. Build a city, which is simulated for you, and you have to make sure it survives. Really? That's the gist. Now, um, I've been watching a lot of B-double-O. B-double-O, if you watch any video of mine, hello come and say hi I follow you on Twitter tweet me up but um there's a lot of do's and don'ts when making a city and I'm not going to pretend to know any of them because I am as many people will probably um refer to me a very 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 bad gamer so what I'm going to do is I'm going to make mistake number one and by the way if you notice this down here this is update seven so this is the biggest update hello phone let's mute you um, I'm going to make the biggest mistake. I'm going to do one great big straight road. Which is, as you can see, taken loads of my money already. But I am going to do this in preparation for how much this will grow. So let's start this going. We can now zone a bit of residential. So let's zone some residential here. And some residential here. And these guys are going to want somewhere to work and to eat and to live. So let's have a little look at the state of things. We have wind going down this way at the moment. Which means if I put any industry up here, it will pollute. But I also want to have some decent power. So um, let's have a look to see what power we can give and I'm going to do another road that's not right that's not connected yeah connect please there we go so down here I'm going to do some industry so that these people have got some jobs to go to I'm also It's a very, very low density road to start with, and I'll probably change our our setup at a later point. I'm going to put in some wind power. We're going to be clean. I never normally want to be clean with this, but I'm going to be clean. And let's have a look at the water map. How's our water? Ooh, it's not great, is it? Let's extend that road a bit more. 
But that means the um, the sewage is not going to be too much of a problem when we get around to it. So water. Let's bring a water tower here, and I'm going to bring some sewage right here at the top. And that's it. Let's watch this grow. Let's zoom in and see a little bit of what's happening. You see, it just lagged a little bit there. But bearing in mind, I I will put my I always put my my specs up. Oh, you are loud. You're loud in my ears. I hope you're not loud. Just turn these sounds down a little. Um, yeah, um, my Mac. Looking up is around about three to four times better than the minimum specs yet I'm still having problems it's around about at least double as good as the recommended specs so why I'm having problems with this I can only blame on maybe internet lag processor lag now bearing in mind I'm recording the video at the moment so with this so that's going to change it a bit but hmm what are you guys building All these little dudes work. Ah, your platform's being raised. Isn't that cool? So let's have a look. Over here. We still haven't got any electricity or any water yet because we haven't got anybody working. And we'll come in. These little houses. Which one's my favourite so far? I like this one. I like the little, I like the little chicken hut. I like you. I hope, so. I hope a nice family moves into you and doesn't burn you down. Oh, somebody's moved in. There they are. Who are you? So who's moved in? The McDowells. Hello, McDowells. And you have the Jones and the Clarks as your neighbours. So unemployed needs work, so they're looking for jobs. A lot of them in that little house. Now this, Brockman. Brockman's going to be our our wasters, I reckon. This this screams of criminal action already, doesn't it? Petition to build a town hall proof, which means we've got electricity. Let's have a look. It's there. And our water is there, and our garbage is being collected. Now, I'm not going to put a town hall down yet. I don't particularly want to. I want to take this city a bit slowly to start. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a bit more, bit more wind up, up in this. There we go. Just get myself a bit more power. Now, it says budget problems loom. We're losing money. That is true. But we're going to be making money soon from all this rent. So that's going to be fan. Just fan. Fan, just fan. I'd say it, it does look good. Um, ooh, that's, that's poor resolution right there, isn't it? It does look good. And it does play really well when it's playing really well. But sometimes it can just really, really bug out and, and play really really jerky and and laggy hello ellen we're gonna follow you we're gonna follow ellen perry let's follow you let's see where you go for a job you look like you're gonna cross the road no no you're gonna carry on walking oh that's not good that's not good block design right there is it if you played minecraft that like i do that would do your head in that's really weird because it's really good here, like just there at the other side of the crossing. So all these people in this in this town, are gonna walk to work. They do actually walk to work, and they walk quite a way. Man, this is this is a good case for buses, really, isn't it? So we have a job. We have industrial already, and a standard factory. Are you going to get a job here? 
Is that where you're going to get a job, Ellen? Come on. Then got to be employing people. Get in there. Oh, I hope you're employed at Jelly Filling and Lubrication <laughs> Company. Oh, Ellen. No. I mean, it's, no, it's, it's not as bad as a sex line, but it, it's pretty bad. You could have done better. I had, I had so much more hope for you. Lenshaw Magnetrons. Ooh. Quickly, Sprocket. Look at that mosquito. What's going up there? What is it? Let's turn that off because we get the happiness. Look at them go. You know, this weird thing. It's like a Bond villain's like death trap. So, we have our first little warning. Why do we have a warning? Unemployment crisis. There are more workers than there are jobs. And there's a massive demand for commercial. So let's put some commercial in. And let's put some commercial in at this top end of the street. And let's see what happens here. Now I'm only playing this on, on slow speed at the moment. Um, I will speed it up. And there will probably be things that I'll do um, AFK from a video. But don't worry, there won't be important things. I'll keep you up to date with them all as, as and when. Your unemployment crisis is going to be sorted soon, I promise you. Now, our Sims, look at them there, all 252 of them in our burgeoning town. And you can see now we're making money. Money is cool. But we need to decide what we're going to do with this town. Now, there isn't, if I bring up the map and I zoom this out, we've got a good train line running down here on this side. We've got a nice little beach running over here. And we don't have any natural resources at all. Which either screams that this is going to be a commuter town. Or this is going to be a tourist town. Now, industry is going to cause a lot of problems in this. Because it's going to be very, very dirty. But, you know, you can change that. And look, and he's already known as Grime. Grime Unlimited. Now, we don't have any demand, any more demand yet for um, for residential. So I'm just going to let this play out on a little click, quicker speed. There we go. There are all those commercials. That's, they're, they're coming up. Ooh. I'd like living here more if there was a park to visit. Well, who is it that said that? The Cook Residence? As soon as I've got a bit more money, I'm going to give you a park. I'll give you, in fact, I'll give you a park right now. In this little black top park right next to your house. There you go. Have a park. Play some hopscotch. Does anybody even play hopscotch anymore? I don't know. You know, it's probably been replaced. That and skipping ropes have been replaced by... um iPhone games and twerking. I don't know. Now, what have we got here? Vacant businesses. Quick and dirty nails. Llama petrol. A biogenic oil. That's interesting. What you? Penultimate taco. Oh. That's got to be the worst taco you ever eat. The one before your last ever. <laughs> You can tell whoever's programming this is at the end has got really, really bored of having to come up with names for different shops. Ribs! Well, all right. Carbonaceous Oil Company. There's three petrol stations in a row. Four. Another one there. One, two, three, four. Blimey. Petrol's popular. I believe we're raining. Yeah, we're raining. We're in the rain. It's cool. The raining and people still playing in the park. Here we got Dion Sanchez. Going to the Sanchez residence. Oh, that's where they, are they. That was a Cook residence. That's not your house. Get out. The Stewart residence. So yeah, we're doing all right. Making some money. So next we are going 
to preempt something as soon as we get some more money up. We're going to build a town hall. I'm going to build this town hall right at the entrance. I f no, I'm not. I want to put it somewhere where um where it can be central. Because this is going to be a, a very, very bustling metropolis, I feel. That'll do. Let's put that there. The next thing we're going to do is when the money comes, we're going to build that garbage dump. But first, we can give this town the name. Now, there's only three towns in this in this area of police box. And I'm going to keep with the Doctor Who theme, I feel. So, in honour, and sorry for any spoilers for those of you that don't know, but if you don't know, you're obviously not very good at internet, are you? I'm going to name this city in honour of our new Doctor, Peter Capaldi. Or Peter Capaldi's swearing. Oh, I can't name it that. Okay, let's name it something to do. Lapels. Okay, now that's going to be a reference to what his doctor might be like because a lot of rumours are the way he held his lapels is very much like the first doctor who's. So, Peter Capaldi's lapels is the name of this city. Oh. Now, for those of you that have already been playing Sim City and gave up on it, you haven't seen this symbol. I have. So let's see what this symbol is. Wait. Mayor Cleaver Slips. I'm really enjoying life here in Clearwater. It's not Clearwater anymore. It's Peter Capaldi's lapels. Deal with it. We have a vibrant, diverse city here. One thing that I wish we had was a place to get in touch with our spiritual side, like a temple, church, mosque, or modern temple. Just, you know, just to cover all of the bases in case they do offend any particular uh, part, branch of religion. <laughs> Let's put everything in. If you help us out, I'm sure the powers of be will look kindly on it. Do you know what? I'm an, I'm an equal opportunities um, deity resident here. I'm playing deity, but I'll give you a deity to worship. I'll do it. But I won't do it yet. First, we're going to get this money up. And we're going to sort out... What will be our inevitable garbage problem? Now, we have a little bit of residential demand. So, for now, I'm going to put in some more houses just down here. Now, don't freak out. I'm, I'm, these are going to completely disappear as this expands into this great, great big city. This is just to help get us on our feet, you know. You know, Peter Capaldi's lapels are going to do wondrous things in the land of police box. Yeah, let's, let's have a look at our little city hall, our little town hall. And now it's got the clock at 12. So is it 12? It's very, um, almost very Back to the Future-esque, isn't it? Nice work, this car parking. Lovely little garden in the back. I like that. I like the garden in the back. So we're just going to keep making that money and I'm going to put a garden camp. Have we got any more houses yet? Any better houses? No, not yet. Nobody's feeling the need. Might get a couple here soon. And as soon as we start putting down some, some other things. Have we got more commercial demand? Only a little tiny bit. Let's fill out this side. And that way it will cover it. We've got medium wealth residential demand already now the land value around here is going to be more because of the city hall so let's, let's have a look at what this land value is going to be like where are we land value there we are you see this is just outside it and this is going to be good it's good for medium wealth it's going to get there so medium wealthers I'm just going to put a couple of bits there. And 
and then we're going to see how that goes. Maybe I might, I might put a little park in either side at a later point, just to just to help them bump up. See, we've already got a couple, couple of things under construction. Industry's doing well. Nobody wants anything more. Although they want somewhere to ship their freight, and they're already making a mess. Look at all this mess they're making already. Awful mess. Dirty industry. Dirty, filthy industry. Eh, let's have a little check on our facilities now. How's the power doing? Power's doing fine. Water's doing fine. Sewage's doing fine. Good job. Good job, everyone. Garbage is next. Now, you're probably wondering, why am I doing garbage so early? And the reason is because I really need somewhere to put the garbage and factor that into the city planning for later because it becomes a bit of an afterthought and it also needs to be somewhere where everybody can get to very easily so the wind's still wind's still going that way right but it's changed a little already look it's, it's just changed its angle so for now what i'm gonna do and i'm sorry to whoever lives there the sinhazis is I'm going to build this this way and of course I will replace it later or move it because I don't want it to pollute anything but I'm going to put this down oh that didn't work did it spending money on roads well let's speed this up a little bit more let's get some, get some of that dollar that simoleon dollar Bang, good job. Right. Garbage dump is down. And because garbage and keeping your city clean is essential for this. And I basically now, with the exception of... I, I have every public service that's going to annoy people's living conditions. That's all covered. So the next thing, of course, is going to be things like fire and police and health way before any of this so we're just going to let this city grow for a while see what we can do see how we can plan if you have any ideas because the one thing i'm always very wary about and i know update 7 has changed this and i have this is update 7 of course is the fact that traffic is always very very bad in sim city so we will try and do something where the traffic is not so bad. So more more reading mail demand is still there. So we're going to make some money and get that sorted. But traffic is always very bad. So if you've got any suggestions as to how I can lay out my city where the traffic is not going to be a massive issue, then let me know. Now I know the main the main thing is not to have big intersections. Big four-way intersections because they back up everything. So I want to keep that down to maybe one as a minimum. And definitely not to do one up here because then that backs the traffic coming into the city as well. But we never know. Ooh, steady flow of water, no problems here. Why? Why thank you, Adam's residence. I do appreciate your input. I wish more more people would move in here. Well, Casarellis, more people will move in here. As soon as I decide to make them do that. I think I have a crush on our mayor. Well, jolly residents. I'm jolly happy you seem to have that crush. <laughs> uh, yeah, no. So, is that... Another taco place? Taqueria. El Titanic. Taqueria is a great name for a place. Although, of course, there's lots of Thai restaurants for Titanic theme. Maybe Uber Scooper. The Golden Llama. I wonder what food you do. 
the spare tire it's donuts Doc Dom's dogs Zombra Troll foods interesting services Crazy Dave's discount audio Crazy Dave Rex Potts I wonder if any of you guys are Crazy Dave I want, I want to know who Crazy Dave is. It's a shame you can't like have a list of business owners in this and find out who they are. Well, we look like we're doing alright, don't we? We look like we're thriving. Now, lots of people here now. Getting up to the 500 number. And as soon as I get to that magic 500... Ooh, a neighbor has a town hall. We should ask them for money. We don't have a neighbor. Now, we're we're right on the edge here of where this town hall gives us some good some good land value. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to build something that medium wealthers will like. And I'm going to put it here so it might affect the other bit as well. That's going to knock you down. We're going to shoot some b-ball up in here. Everybody likes some basketball, apart from people that like the NBA and think it's rigged. I know some people think, oh, look at this already. No names of Americanage. NBA isn't rigged, apparently. Look at this. That's what we want. Medium wealth. Perfect. That worked like a... Oh. Who, who built a pink house that's that's not right see this I can deal with this is like the house from Millennium with Lance Henriksen this one that could be any house in America this one maybe maybe the Simpsons house this is, this is as close as I can think of to anybody having a pink house it's terrifying look at this I've got whole teams playing Ah, oh, good dunk. Good dunk, sir. Oh, look at the, the garage doors opening. Moved in already. Construction zones here. Be careful. Don't think so. Life's good and saving up money to buy a bigger house. Well, I'll have to find somewhere to give you a bigger house to do that. You got some dreams, big boys. You got some dreams. <laughs> The glass is almost certainly not half empty. That's scientifically proven. Wow. Living here is going to be fun. It sure is going to be fun. Adams. Oh, Adams, you're always so complimentary of me. I can finally take a shower now that we've got water. You've had water, Stuart. It's fine. How's our industry doing then? Industry do good. And our land values. Obviously, that land lab, blah, that land value is going to be terrible. Now, let's see what I have done here. I might. Can I sneak you through the middle of that without tearing down another house? No, I can't. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create our first. Is that straight? It's really hard to tell. Yeah, the guides in this, never particularly great at getting things... Oh, I don't want that road. I want a low-density road to start with. Good thing here, another good tip that's, um, that we've heard from B00 and other people that have told him this, is to never start off with big roads. What you need to do is start off with these kind of little roads so that when your density needs to increase, instead of having a plot new houses and build stuff up you just upgrade the roads so you like you pre-plan almost see already already we've got more medium wealthers coming in not that there's anywhere for them to shop yet let's give them a little couple of shops right here this is all medium wealth just just a little couple there big shop it'll be fine everybody will like it see these all that's a medium welfare, and that's a low welfare. 
Oh, you're just the other side. Oh, you are an interesting enigma. You, on the other hand, you're very medium wealth. And you look like you're a supermarket. Oh, that looks cool. Although you seem to have some strange, strange thing here. I don't know what that is. Nobody knows what that is. Well, here we go. We are nearly... Nearly at 500 residents. Slowly creeping our way up. We haven't had any complaints yet. Business seems to be doing well. And I think at this point... This point... I'm going to put down somewhere to worship and I'm going to finish this this nice man here. I'm going to finish I'm going to finish his wish. So you will find this under culture and worship. So what have we got? We have these are all free. But be careful. Don't bulldoze a church. Very interesting. Now do I want a scenic church? Do I want a mosque? Do I want a modern temple? It's not a modern place yet, I don't think. Or do I want the kind of almost Shinto like shrine? I'm gonna go I'm gonna go classic. I'm gonna go for a church. It's a very big church, isn't it? I'm gonna put that down right there. So I'm gonna plop a house of worship. And we're gonna have more people coming. It's very nicely built, isn't it? I'd say that all a bit very very, very cool, because then you've got um other landmarks in the game. Let's, let's find some of these landmarks. You can't really, you can't use them yet. You know things like the, the the arch here. You've got the Brandenburg Gate. There's also there's a cathedral. Ooh. Ah, there's cathedrals and stuff as well. That look, that look really cool with these guys as well. Oh, you're new. Ah, take your tower. So yeah, let's um let's speed this up. And this six AM to eight AM and six PM to eight PM. That's gonna be our worship times. So we need to have eighty low wealth sims attend it and to for eighty to attend it in a day. Doing well in this town, I think it'd be renovating soon. Good for you. You on the other hand. That is not cool. You need to you need to sharpen your game, Mr. Caravan owner. Let's go take a little look at our industry. Let's see how messy they're being. Oh, some yeah, look again, more mess. I'm not going to clear up for you all the time. I hope you know that. Oh, we have some renovations. I did just see somebody renovating down here into a new house. I thought no, no. I was imagining things. It's probably just a park. So here we go. It's six o'clock. Oh, sorry about that. To hit my microphone. Oh, 27. 24, 39. Do you reckon we can get to 80 in this first bit and finish that off? Come on. We're halfway there. Okay. I think we're going to get both of these in one day. If we get people coming along to this evening one, we're going to leave this going and get the evening one. What are these people saying about us? They're saying, as a lawyer, I need a good suit. Couldn't we all use a good lawsuit? Oh, I see what they did. Well, I can either watch Paint Dry or play an online social game. Hmm, let's see. Not too good on bigging yourself up there, are you, SimCity? Hmm. There was a little angry one. I'm not sure what the angry one was. Missed it. But that was at the town hall. It was about money. I think they're happy that I'm not bringing in a lot of money yet. Um, power's fine. Water's fine. Sewage's fine. Garbage. Not getting all the garbage. Are you seriously telling me that? There you go. This a bit. Yeah, come on. Are you seriously telling me you're not getting all of the garbage in this small, only 444 person town? Exactly. This garbage coverage is excellent. And it will always be excellent. 
here in Peter Capaldi's lapels. <laughs> Very specific place on Peter Capaldi. Um, well, we're just going to speed this down to see if we can get the 80 people and finish finish this little guy he's got a strange strange face looks like he's familiar but not he's got a really cool hat maybe you should start up a hat shop sir oh look oh look we have the Gutierrez household they've 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 gone a bit bigger I like I like your house colour oh it's the yellow house that is definitely more Millennium with Lance Henriksen uh, Millennium was a spin-off series of X-Miles, if you don't know. And very, very good. At least the first series was. The second series got a little bit weird. And the third series, again, the same. Jollies! Oh, Jollies, I'm glad you've upgraded. You were nice to me. You've got a pretty cool house. I'd live there. I'd live there if I could. Oh, you're, I'm getting rid of this shack soon and moving to my dream home. Well, you're in a bank. A, the loophole corporate bank. I wonder what their main interests are. That mayor of ours, he's pretty cool for a mayor. Well, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll take that. <laughs> All right, here we go. Service number two. Let's see how many sims we get. We're going to hit the 80, I feel. Yeah, we've hit the 80. Done. We've hit it. I know how to add. 53 plus 31 is 84. We've done that. Well, maybe not all of them are low wealth. Ooh. Oh, I see. Well, we'll finish that next time. Anyway, thank you very much for watching this video. And there's going to be a whole series of these. If you want to see more, please remember to subscribe and leave a like. Because leaving likes are cool. Leave comments. And I will see you next episode. Bye-bye.